हेलो गाइस इट्स यूनिट थ्री पार्ट एम हेलो गाइस टुडे टॉपिक इज मॉडिलिटीज ऑफ डायग्नोसिस इन्वेशन एंड नॉन इन्वेशन हियर यू विल सी दैट व्हाट आर द स्क्रीनिंग एंड डायग्नोसिस दैट इज डन इन द टाइम ऑफ प्रेगनेंसी टू सी द फीटल ग्रोथ एंड द हेल्थ ऑफ द वुमेन जनरली इट इज टू टाइप दैट इज नॉन इन्वेस्टिव एंड इन्वेस्टिव मेथड what is non invasive and invasive method invasive method in the sense we generally hurt the patient like we insert the syringe into their body or we will do some kind of cutting for collecting the samples a general example is for collecting blood we usually insert the needle into the patient's body to collect the sample so it's a best example for invasive method for non invasive method we have an example like bp to check a bp we will tie the cuff in their hand and then collect the bp counting this is not painful and there is no insertion there is no cutting is occurred in this non invasive method now let's see what are the tests that is performed in the time of pregnancy non invasive method generally sees observation or palpation like examining the women's uterus from outside the body outside the body they usually palpate or observe and examine how the uterus is growing ultrasound detection ultrasound detection in the sense we see the fetal movement and growth listening to fetal heart sound listening to fetal heart sound and then there is a test like nst and cst this is used to detect the fetal's heart sound heart beat and how the baby is responding whether the baby is active or not this nst and cst is very important you will see it later in detail invasive method in invasive method we have chorionic villi sampling chorionic villi sampling is done by collecting the chorionic villi those sample is collected and this is present in placenta by this examination you will come to know whether the baby is getting enough amount of blood or not enough amount of nutrition is provided or not either enough amount of oxygen is supplied or not by this examination you will come to know amniocentesis in amniocentesis we usually collect amniotic fluid from the mothers Womb, that is amniotic sac and in that we will check whether this amniotic fluid is consisting enough amount of nutrition or not next fetoscopy fetoscopy is nothing but you know there will be probe which is inserted into the uterus that is it will be in a rod like shape it will be inserted into the uterus to observe whether the uterus is in the proper condition or not whether the uterus has enough blood or not whether the uterus is healthy or not is there any damage that can be seen in the embryo everything will be observed this is invasive method questions will be provided at the end of the chapter until then stay tuned meet you in the next video